everyone welcome to the starlight realm by jess i'm jess and here for a whipping chat thanks for coming going to um still be working on diamond dots um the great wave and this is a square diamond dots uh painting i am using my pen from um amazon with the metal three placer metal single placer both with pink wax and the tray is by add more zest um rebecca four kids at 147 and uh yeah get started hope you guys are having a good day um been a very emotional couple of days my um my boss actually got laid off yesterday um which is very stressful because then that makes me basically the boss um so as i told you guys i work for a title company i work in the real estate ind industry for a bank and um, as I'm sure some of you know the um, here in America the the economy and the interest rates are not good um, interest rates have been going up they haven't been this high it's now prime is now 7.00 and it literally hasn't been that high since 2007 and that was right before the whole market fell apart and crashed no wait so, I'm very worried, um, very stressed, taking on a lot of extra work, and just, um, you know, trying to stay calm and focused, just get everything done. I, um, I, I just feel so bad. It's right before the holidays. And nobody likes to see anybody get laid off, you know. I mean, I'm happy it wasn't me, but I'm not happy that it was her. So, and of course, my my whole team is feeling it. Um, I'm the team leader, and so I've basically been pulled from production because somebody has to do all the things that my boss did. Which I did when she was on vacation and stuff, but this is now a new level of uh, of it. So, and it's teaching people, you know, reports and things that they weren't doing so that they can help me out. And so that when I take my vacation, which I've already got some days set up, um, it doesn't affect, you know, it doesn't affect the team in a negative in a negative way so I'm just worried you know it's it's crazy times right now I've never seen the industry this bad um, you know of course the the fallout back in 08 was was bad um, it took quite a while for for the recovery um, so yeah it's just it's rough it's, it's, I shed a lot of tears yesterday because I did like my boss I genuinely like her she's she's a good person and everything and um, you know she's got a family and her husband had COVID, he, he's recovered, you know, but he's having some of the long-term effects of COVID. Um, so, it's just, you know, it sucks, it's rough. I, um, I just pray for them, you know. I told her that if she needs to put me as a reference for 
her resume and stuff, like not to hesitate. If she needs something, not to hesitate. Like I just feel real bad, you know? I mean, it's not my fault I didn't pick her to be, you know, that all comes from upper management. But it's just sucks. She wasn't the only person, there were five let go. Um, so, I don't know, it's just, rough. So, if you hear talking and stuff in the background, my husband's playing uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, so you may hear some stuff. Um, he's playing with my brother online. I mean, like, what do you guys think? Do you guys, like, you ever been in that position where, like, your boss, your boss got laid off? Now you're the boss? Like, everybody's looking at me. It's not like I've not been the boss before. I mean, I, I, you know, I can do it. I do do it. I've been doing it. I don't know. Just trying to like keep my head down and do as much as I can, learn as much as I can, be as valuable as I can, you know? It's just... You know, I don't know. Oh, well, right. So, I'm working on this kit, and um, I think when I get through with this row, I'll be like halfway done which is good, like road this way. Um, I'm gonna do an unboxing of my next kit, which is a diamond art club. Um, it's a round. Uh, I haven't done a round in a little while. I usually try to have a round and a square kitted up, but um, I got topsy-turvy on that um, because I really wanted to work on kitchen helpers and I already had this one kitted up um, and I just you know I was like screw it I'm gonna do it I'm gonna kit up two squares <laughs> so it's fine plus I want to you know get my like a good bit of spares going for my um, like either heaven and earth designs or my other patterns that um cross stitch conversion patterns that i have i um i saw where joanne fabrics sells um plain kits from diamond dots and with the grid on them and it's a square grid and I'm wondering if squares like fit snug on there or not. Um, so I'm thinking I might buy some of the little ones and um, give those a shot before like I, I plop down the money for a big one. <coughs> Pardon me. I took a coughing fit a little bit ago. My drainage is just not, it's not been good. Um, but other than that, health is all right. Just tired and stressed out, you know. Getting, gearing up for Thanksgiving. I am hosting, so I've got to get a turkey and stuff. I, uh, I do 
what they call dressing, not stuffing. I don't stuff my turkey. Um, so I have to get the things for that. And um, my family does help. There, you know, there are they are going to be helping with things. So it's not too big of a burden. I mean, you know, it's still a lot because you have to do all the cooking and cleaning and stuff. But it won't be that bad. I've done it for years. On and off. More on than off. <laughs> My husband's an only child, so he, his mom, if, if we don't host, his mom doesn't have anywhere to go. I mean, she could go to, like, her sisters or something or her brothers, but it's not the same as being with your kid and grandkids, so. So, yeah. So, hosting again. Are you hosting Thanksgiving? Are you having turkey or you do non-traditional we have done non-traditional in the past where I made like tacos or lasagna or whatever um, but everybody wants turkey this year Sophia my husband so, so turkey it shall be and I cook mine in one of those oven bags so that um, it doesn't have to cook as long and it stays nice and moist and everything. That's how my my grandmother did it and so that's how I do it. Like, that's how I learned, so you know what I mean? Why mess with, with something that works? So... did order some paintings from Diamond Art Club this past weekend. Um, one new release, one not. Um, those should be here tomorrow, my tracking says. So I'm excited about that. So I'll be doing an unboxing for those and get that up for you guys. Um, so... Um, so yeah, I'll get those, get those unboxed and show them to you. Probably one per video, like I don't think I'm going to do, um, both of them in the same, in the same video. Spread it out a little bit so that, you know, we can focus, <laughs> not feel rushed. Did any of you guys get the the um, advent calendar. I watched um, Emeralds and Fairy Lights. Um, forgive me, I forget her first name, but I watched her unbox it, um, and she went ahead and unboxed like the whole thing. Like major spoiler alerts if you bought it. Um, and, and I'm gonna talk about it, so you know more spoiler alerts. Um, but it has like two diamond paintings in it. And I did like the diamond paintings. I was like, oh, you know, those are cute. Um, they're smaller diamond paintings. They're not big at all. Um, I think the cost of it was like a hundred and something dollars. And then they had a, I think it was like a 20% off code. So it ended up being like $90. But there was two diamond paintings. There was some diamond painting stickers. Uh, I think a card, like a diamond painting, like greeting card, a, 
think there was a single placer and some multi placers maybe release papers two pens uh, diamond painting pens again they were pretty there was like a red sparkly and a green sparkly so like Christmas seed colors um, I think there was 12 things is that is that 12 two pens two diamond paintings release papers a washi tape um what else did I say I don't know you can go over to to her channel and watch it if you if you want um but yeah I mean it was a nice little thing I don't I don't I don't know 90 bucks though it's kind of I don't know that's why I didn't buy it because of the cost I was just like oh with Christmas coming you know and all the costs with that because I do have kids and and family to buy for and everything and then um, with the with the industry you know that I work in with my job being a little scary I just um, I'm trying to keep my spending down. I really shouldn't have bought the two Diamond Art Club paintings that I did buy, but the one I'd been eyeballing and it said it was on last chance, um, which means that they're not going to restock. So I was like, I better pick it up. And then the other one uh, was limited edition, uh, new release. So um, I decided I'd pick it up too. Plus it's really... It's really cute, um, and it'll go it'll go in the kids' bedroom. So I have to. I'm I'm waiting on a Joanne coupon to come in the mail because I want to go check out um, how much they would charge me to frame kitchen helpers. Um, if it's like insanely too much, my husband and I said we were gonna figure out how to do it ourselves. So, yeah, that's going to happen. got thank you cards I need to write up for band boosters need to do that next couple of days and get those out and then I want to I need to get the minutes from the last meeting typed up I still have not gotten to meet the new band director she still has not made an appearance at any of the band booster meetings it was really kind of disappointing because, like, we're, we're, we're there supporting the band and the kids and everything. What we do is very important, and I would think that it would be important for her to come meet us, you know what I mean? Um, but um, from, I don't know. Like, I don't want to judge or whatever, and I guess she had a real hard time with her last band booster organization. But, like, I really think that we're, like, really approachable, you know, like, I don't know. I don't know. I would think she'd want to come meet us, though. 
I mean, she's met the booster president. You know, she had a meeting with her and admin for the school when she came on and everything, which is all well and good, but, you know, Jessica doesn't make up the whole organization. So, it's just like, you know what I mean? It's disappointing. Like, come meet us. Come, come talk to us. Come see, you know, what we're about, who we are. I guess I just don't like feeling like we're not important to her, you know what I mean, when we're doing all of the fundraising and we're doing, you know what I mean, like all of that stuff. We're making sure that the kids are fed, we're making sure that the kids' instruments are, are you know, taken care of, and buying uniforms, and drum heads, and I don't know, I just, I don't like feeling not appreciated, or unappreciated, however you want to put it. Whoops. Straggler. Straggler. I don't know, is that just me? Like, do you, you know... I know she's new, I know she's probably still getting acclimated or whatever, but I just, I don't know. I find a little rude. That she hasn't made the effort. Whatever. Whatever, right? Whatever. I guess. I don't know, guys. All the Christmas stuff is starting, and I'm not ready. I think it's just because, like, I I need to get through Thanksgiving first. And we'll put up our tree the day after Thanksgiving. So, that's what we always do. Um, like, that day, the next, like, Black Friday slash over the weekend. Um, it's just just what we do tradition in our house so I don't know I'm not ready I mean Christmas like presents and stuff are bought the kids are done um, but um, but um, <coughs> We haven't started on like our parents and stuff yet. My niece. So. Oh. I knew I heard one go. All the way down there. Oh, there's another one. Two. So there were like three that three that got away. Feels like there's one sticking. Like the like this one here is sticking up too. Is there a tab on it? Well they're like stuck together. Two of the um A B's. Yeah, it's making them not sit evenly. You see that? See that? They're like stuck together. that up there. Crash. Uh, we're on to our last one for this square. Finish up the square and it is the AB. 
beautiful white AB. Something about them white ABs. I don't know if anybody else really loves white ABs, but I really love white ABs. I just think they're so pretty. They just add like so much sparkle. You know what I mean? Like, good lord, look at that. Bam, 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 bam. Just dot them all around. I hope you guys are having a good day or evening, weekend, whenever you're watching this. I appreciate you watching my videos. I hope you like them. hope you're liking and subscribing. Um, you know, let me know if there's anything you want to see. Um, I, I'm more than happy to accommodate. And, um, yeah, I'm about to hit 10 subscribers, so that's exciting. I know it's not as exciting as hitting a thousand or, you know, a million or whatever, but I really do appreciate each and every one of you that has subscribed to me. Um, it means a lot. I, I started this channel not knowing if anybody would want to listen to me ramble on and on. Um, and some of you do, so I'm, I'm excited about that. Let me know what you want to hear. Let me know if you have any questions for me. Um, diamond painting or otherwise. Um, yeah. Because I really, um, I do enjoy diamond painting and I enjoy talking to you guys. I, I'd like to start hearing from you guys like if you know your you know what you're working on or how your day is going you know oh are we remembering to do our medic meditation remember we talked about meditation weeks ago um i have to be honest i have not been doing my med my meditation and i know that that um you know works into like my mental health not being good um, but I really, you know, work, like, <laughs> work has been stressful, and now it's even more stressful, so it's just, I just haven't taken that time for self-care, and I need to. Look at that. Aren't those beautiful? Look at those beautiful ABs. Oh, where did I pull those others out? Oh, right down here. Let's put those in. Before we forget about it. Like I almost did. There we go. Piece of wax or something right there. Look at that. So pretty. And those squares. These squares fit together really nice. Really nice. Well, that is it for the evening. I hope that you all are having a good day. And all that, like we said, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please do all the things before you go. Like, subscribe, share with your friends. You know, I, I'm really trying to get the, the channel to grow. And, um, you know, we'll be doing some fun stuff. Like I said, I got a, a um, couple of unboxings coming up. And kidding up that needs to be done. Um trying to wait to do that on the weekend with Sophia because she really enjoys doing kidding up with me um kidding up and kidding down and uh it's a big help to have a second set of hands oh it's stuck open up the next square oh there we go I'm actually gonna move this one too so anyway guys, as I said, thank you so much for coming, for joining me for this whip and chat. It wasn't a very long one, but I hope you all enjoyed it. And again, like, subscribe, all of the things. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, evening, morning, whatever it may be. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone.